tension reaction mechanism and it's presented to you by science visualized. In E2 elimination mechanism, we need a substrate, which in this case is an alkyl halide, and a base. And the product will always be a double bond. So it gives an alkyl product. It's very important for E2 elimination that the living group, that's this bromine, and the hydrogen to be abstracted, that's H2, level 2 there, must have what we call anti-arrangement, so anti-periplanar. So, for example, if you have something like this, if one group is going in, say bromine, then the other group must be coming out, the hydrogen. So that means you have about 180 degrees. So it's a trans relationship. We call that anti